Hey, Willie. Uh, meeting with the uh, Re Review Journal here in Las Vegas. Welcome to Las Vegas. Um, hey, what was it? It happened pretty quick. It sounds like you got to town probably today over to Anderson today. Uh, what was it about the Raiders, and what have they told you about any kind of a role uh, to expect this year? Uh, you know, I'm just grateful to have this opportunity. You know, when it happened, uh, I got a phone call from Coach Gruden, and uh, we were able to talk for a little bit. And, uh, you know, just the vision that he has for this offense, and I'm pretty familiar from the Saints, my time with the Saints, you know, just with scheme and everything that they do. You know, I was just really excited about possibly being here in Oakland, I mean, Oakland, Vegas. And, uh, you know, it's been, it's been an awesome experience since I stepped in the building. You know, everybody's been first class, and, uh, I've just been feeling right at home, so really excited for opportunity here in Vegas and uh, just looking forward to when we come back for football. Hey, Willie, Jerry McDonald from the Bay Area News Group up, uh, up in the Bay Area. Um, it, it's a pretty crowded wide receiver room with a couple of, of, of rookies that they drafted high last year. and and uh, Hunter Renfro and Zay Jones, who they brought back. Uh, I, I suppose it's going to be comp competition on every NFL team, but how do you look at that aspect of it? I just look at it as an opportunity to get better. Um, you know, they have a lot of great talent in the room already, and, uh, you know, they're bringing me in just to build on top of that. And uh, what I bring into that room is a toughness, uh, a leadership role, uh, a veteran presence, you know, and just going out there and going to make plays. You know, um, I'm excited for the competition. Uh, they have a great group, great group of guys already. You know, I just want to be able to mold myself in there and contribute where I can. So, you know, I invite competition. I love the aspect of that part. And Gruden seems to be all about, you know, competing and, and making guys better. So uh, that fits my mold. So I'm just excited to be here and uh, ready to get to work. Hey, Willie, Paul Gutierrez here from ESPN. Um, when, when you look at the Raider roster and what that offense has done, and, and, and like Dre just asked you about the competition throughout the, the receiver room especially, and I know you touched on it a little bit about what you bring to the slot, the toughness, the veteran leadership, things like that. What do you think about your game meshes really well with this offense? Yeah, like back when I was in New Orleans, uh, you know, it was more of that West Coast spread spread type of deal. And, uh, you know, I was just able to move around to a whole bunch of places. I was a versatile player during that time. And, uh, you know, in this type of offense, you know, the more you can do, you know, they'll keep you on the field. And, uh, you know, that's what I prided myself on when I ca first came in the league was just trying to learn every position, whether it's the slot, whether it's outside. You know, I just wanted to learn it all and be able to go out there and execute and just gain that trust from the coaches knowing that I can do it and they can put me anywhere out there and I could be successful. So um, that's the kind of the same mentality I have coming here. Um, just it's like a fresh start, fresh opportunity for me um, just to learn the offense and learn every position. So wherever coach thinks I'm going to be, you know, fit in best for them, you know, that's where he's going to put me and I'm going to do my best to be successful at it. So just coming in here with a brand new mindset and uh, a new vision, so to speak. Well, you've played on in some big games uh, and been a part of some some really good teams. Uh, this is a team, a young team that's trying to get there. Um, do you feel like what you bring can that experience can translate uh, to some of these young guys on, on getting to that next level? Yeah, I mean, like you said, I've been a part of a couple big games. I've been a been a part of being with veterans like Drew Brees and and other guys of that nature. So I know what it takes to win. I've been a part of winning cultures, um, and I definitely think that. You know, bringing me in or bringing in a, a John Brown, those type of guys, you know, we could definitely change the culture here. And, uh, you know, I'm just excited to have that opportunity to give some of my leadership presence and veteran uh, style leadership to this organization. And, uh, you know, just to contribute where I can, like I said, um, you know, this, this organization is right on the cusp of being in the playoffs. You know, I was watching from a distance last year, and this organization won a lot of great games, you know, a lot of close games last year. And, um, you know, sometimes it just takes one or two pieces to get over that hump. So, you know, I'm, I'm hoping I could be that piece for this team and uh, to just come in here and help win more games. That's the focus. Hey, Willie, this is Vic with The Athletic. Uh, what was your meeting like with John Gruden? And you guys met before uh, yesterday? Uh, everything was over the phone. You know, I just got to know him and, and, you know, what he sees in the vision, not only for me, but for this team. And uh, I just got to get to know John Gruden a little bit more. You know, he's a personal, he's a personal guy. 
and uh, I can relate to him in a whole bunch of ways. So, you know, it's just awesome getting to know a legendary coach like that and just, you know, to be a part of this organization, a great organization. Um, you know, it just, it just all felt right. And uh, when he asked me to come out to take a visit, you know, I was on, on vacation at the time and uh, we were actually here on the West Coast already. So it was nothing but a quick plane ride and uh, getting in this building and just to meet all the coaches, meet him for the first time. And uh, it was a great experience. So it happened to work out for the best. And uh, I'm just excited to be here, man. Hey, Willie, this is uh, Paul Gutierrez again. Looking back, I can't, can't believe it's already going to be five years ago, but that 2016 season opener, Saints, Raiders, <laughs> you had a monster game, nine catches, 172, a touchdown. And then the Raiders go for two at the end to win it. Um, what do you remember about that Raider offense, especially, you know, in particular, Derek Carr, what type of quarterback he is, and now he'll be the guy throwing you passes? Yeah, I just all I remember was those guys were scoring fast. And, uh, you know, they had a great offense. Derek Carr was at a younger point in his career, not saying that he's old, but he was still slinging that thing around like it was nothing. And, you know, he was just starting to emerge as a, a, a great quarterback in this league. And I just got to see the versatile, versatility of the offense. You know, when we talk about Crabtree, Amari Cooper, Seth Roberts, those guys were being used during that time. And that's why that team went to the playoffs that year because they were so great on offense and they were, were able to do so many great things. So. Uh, when I looked at that offense, man, they were explosive. You know, they were fast. They scored points. And, you know, that's, that's what I see th now with this team, just watching from afar last year. You know, you guys, we were right there. And, uh, you know, just to be a part of that now, you know, it's exciting because I know what I can do. I know what I bring to the table. And uh, just hearing what John Gruden has to say about me and the offense going forward, uh, you can't help but be excited. So I'm looking forward to the opportunity again. And, uh, this is just a great place to be. I'm excited. Any other questions, guys? Okay, thank you, Willie. Thanks, guys. Appreciate y'all.